My name is Doug Packer and I'm the conservation agent for the town of Newbury. I am also the chair of the Conservation Commission. Okay, so what what is that what does your position mean? What is that? Um, my duties are to administer the Wetlands Protection Act and the regulations and the wetlands bylaw in town to take a look at common properties that the, the town owns uh, and to manage those properties. Uh, to look at floodplain regulations and to assist the building inspector as the floodplain manager. He's the floodplain manager. Uh, and we're a small town, so if it's got water in the title, it'll usually come to this office. Okay. So how do, how do you work with the Conservation Commission? What is the Conservation Commission and what, you know, how does that work? The Commission reviews permits, permitting to work in a wetland resource area. So when you're, when you're in, if you hit a trigger and you're in one of these wetland resource areas, you'll file some sort of, of document with the Conservation Commission. Uh, that document would be, uh, it would be akin to a building permit application. So a notice of intent is what you bring to the Conservation Commission. Um, again, it's like a building permit application. What you get out of it is an order of conditions, which is akin to your building permit. Um, so we review the project. Uh, the all the, all the resource areas that are listed in the Wetlands Protection Act uh, have performance standards and mitigating measures. So you'll review a project for performance and conformance with those regulations. Uh, if they have mitigated their short and long-term impacts, then that project rises to the top, usually gets an order of conditions, um, and you're allowed to proceed with your project. So what's your role on Plum Island with all the stuff that usually happens this time of the year? Uh, the role on Plum Island would be to, to I help monitor, uh, and then my role usually comes later in the game, um, would be if you need to protect, protecting measures, if you're gonna do some sort of protection down on Plum Island. The minute you cross that bridge, you are on the resource area or in the resource area. Um, most of the most actions on Plum Island um, require some level of permitting and it can be anything from an emergency certification which can be written out in a few minutes and may be implemented immediately uh, to a full filing of a notice of intent which could take months sometimes years to obtain hmm. okay so um, is there anything else you want to add yeah, I was trying to think before you came in here, really, if there was something that would, would make it clearer to people. Um, the only thing I can add is that because that we're a small office, we generally multitask in here. So our, our tasks are to assist, uh, you know, most of us work very closely together.